welcome to today's video. So today I'm going to be sharing the skincare routine that I use when I'm incorporating copper peptides. Now this video was highly requested and I can understand why because with copper this can be a finicky ingredient and we should be cautious on what we pair it up with. So if you want to pair up copper peptides with a direct acid, a retinol, a retinoid, or a vitamin C, you should just be cautious because this could be a harsh pairing and it could lead to further irritation and dryness. So when I use copper, I like to keep it simple. I use it a couple of nights a week when I'm not using my prescription tretinoin. And since using copper, I feel like I have seen a big difference with my skin. It feels firmer, it also feels more soft, and I just feel like that copper takes it to the next level. So if you're using a regular peptide serum and you're really not seeing a difference with your skin, then maybe up it to the copper peptides because again, that copper makes a big difference. And of course, this is my own opinion, but I really do think it's a lot better. So let me show you the routine that I use when I'm incorporating this ingredient. And if you haven't seen my updated morning and evening skincare routines, I will leave those below for you in my description box as well as up here. And don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell. And also, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up as well. So in case you are new here, I have normal decombination skin and I do have some redness and discoloration to my skin as well. And I feel like I always have to say that because I do get people commenting saying that I have redness and I'm well aware that I have redness. I've had it for a while now and I am trying to use products to help with this. And I'm also getting IPL laser treatments done by my dermatologist as well to treat that discoloration and to hopefully get more of that even skin tone in time. So skincare is a journey and I am hopeful. So when I use copper peptides, I like to use this in my evening skincare routine. You can use it both morning and evening if you want to, but I like to use my vitamin C and my other antioxidants in the morning routine. And then of course, tretinoin, direct acids and peptides at night. Of course, I don't use all of these together, but I like to use these specific ingredients at night. So the first thing that I like to do in my evening skincare routine is to remove my makeup and my sunscreen. And I like using the Pharmacy Very Cherry Clean Cleansing Balm. This does a good job to loosen everything up as that first cleanse. And then I will go in with my second cleanse afterwards with my cleanser of choice. Now, like I mentioned in my morning and evening skincare routine, these are the two cleansers that I'm currently using. So the Inky List Oat Cleansing Balm, as well as the CeraVe Hydrating Cleanser. I really love these, they're gentle and they're moisturizing. And I used the CeraVe today and I've already pre-cleansed my skin prior to filming this video. So the first product that I'm gonna be using first is Neod Superoxide Dismute Saccharide Mist. I use this every day, twice a day, no matter what skincare product I am using. So this will prevent transepidermal water loss. It helps to allow all of your serums and moisturizers to absorb into the skin. This is a great product to use throughout the day to add more hydration and to give the skin that nice glow. And if you have redness or inflammation, this can actually help to decrease that. And it's wonderful. So I'm going to put this all over my face and my neck. This has a beautiful mist. And once that's all on the skin, I just gently pat it into the skin. And I do like to apply majority of all of my products to damp skin. So in this skincare routine, I will be applying everything to damp skin, including the copper peptides. So once I've done that, I'm now going to go in with Neod Copper Amino Isolate Serum number three. I've been using this for a very long time and I love it. I also really like the Ordinary Buffet Plus Copper Peptides 1%, but I feel like this one works a lot better in my opinion. So I'm actually almost done this bottle, so let's see how much I can get from it. So it's blue in color like that and I will put about a syringe full into the palm of my hand and I do put this down my neck as well. I do go underneath the eyes with this also. And this texture is like water so your skin just drinks it up and it gets quickly absorbed. It does not leave a tacky, sticky feel. I also find that this product never pills with skincare products. None of the products that I'm using in this video pill, which is very important. 
And again, this product is so effective. It really helps with fine lines and wrinkles. It helps to firm up the skin. And the copper actually can help to produce new collagen production as well, which is why I really like the copper. So now I'm going to apply the Ordinary Amino Acids Plus B5, which is a hydrator. This is not necessary, but I really do like to keep my skin as hydrated as possible. So I do put a full syringe full of this into the palm of my hand. And this really helps to keep the skin nice and hydrated. And if you're someone that is a little bit sensitive to copper peptides, then perhaps you may want to incorporate this serum into your skincare routine because again, it really helps to keep that skin balanced and moisturized. And I do go underneath the eyes with this as well. So now I'm going to use the Inculus Niacinamide Serum. This is a must have ingredient in my skincare routine, whether it's in my morning or in my evening. This really helps to prevent breakouts. And if I have any post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation caused by breakouts, this really helps to fade those areas pretty quick. So I'm gonna do about four drops of this. And I'm going to apply this all over my face and my neck. This serum is very moisturizing and I love the texture of this. It's not too sticky or tacky and it just works with all of my skincare products. One of the best for sure. So now I'm going to apply an eye serum and this is Neod Fractionated Eye Contour Concentrate. I've been using this for a very long time and this really is effective. It has a lovely texture and it's quite hydrating as well. So this is full of peptides. So this is going to be lovely to treat those fine lines and to keep the skin around the eyes smooth and bright. And I really like incorporating this when I'm using the copper. So I'm going to apply one drop to my ring finger. And that's honestly all you need for both of your eyes. So that little bottle there will last you a very long time. This product spreads very nice. And it does get absorbed pretty quick as well. So I do like to go on my eyelids with this and just pat it in. And the last product is the Dermatology Peptide Night Cream. I really like using different peptides in the same skincare routine, although it's not necessary, but I really love this cream. So I'm gonna be using this, and this also has ceramides in it, as well as shea butter and vitamin E. So if you rather use a regular face cream, then go for it, but I really love this cream in particular. So I'm going to apply this all over my face and my neck. I'm not going to be applying an eye cream because I've already done that eye serum. So I'm basically just going to be bringing this underneath my eyes. And this is very moisturizing. Dermatology has a lot of lovely products and this is one of my favorites for sure. And the last product is by Patrick Ta, and this is the Lip Mask. And I use this every day, morning and night, and several times during the day. And it keeps the lips nice and moisturized and plump. And I love it. So that is my skincare routine that I use when I'm incorporating copper peptides. I really hope that you enjoyed it and that you found it helpful. And hopefully I was able to give you a couple of ideas on some products that you can also incorporate in your skincare routine if you're using copper. I will leave all of the products that I shared in this video below for you for your reference. And I will also leave my updated morning and evening skincare routine for you guys as well down below. Thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it. And of course, I will see you all in my next video. Take care and I will see you guys then. Bye guys.